Pets are like family members. We want them to be on their best behavior. Good evening, everybody. I'm Trisha Keen. And I'm Todd Quinona. Specialized dog training fetches top dollar prices here in Las Vegas and also promises the best dog for your home. But one family who entrusted their pet to a longtime local trainer was devastated with the results. 13 Chief Investigator Darcy Spears has her warning to your family. Come on. Bubba. The Mansfield family is all about second chances. Give me that ball. Give me that ball. Rescue dogs Bella and Oreo are cases in point. Adopt them to have a great life and a nice home and love. I was trying to do what everybody thought would be right for Oreo. As you can see in this video from Annette's ring doorbell, Oreo's size and strength became too much to handle, so she signed up with Sit Mean Sit dog trainer Billy Salcedo and paid $1,954 for an immersion training program. Taking my baby. You know, please take good care of him. I'll see him in a few days. Things are going to be great. Oreo would live in Salcedo's home for a week of obedience training, which included the use of a sit mean sit shock collar. He showed us the collar. He showed us how it would work. More or less, it would be more on the vibration to get his attention. She trusted the highly qualified trainer, but got concerned early on when she asked for proof of payment and a copy of her contract. I asked for a receipt. It took three days and for him to come back to the house. Another video from her doorbell shows Salcedo dropping off the paperwork without ringing the bell or talking to anyone, even though they were all at home. The red flags went up for me at that point. Let's go. Up. Part of what they paid for were videos of Oreo in training. In one, he seemed exhausted, but okay. In the second... No, I gotta watch it again. Let me look at his eyes. Let me make sure everything's okay. By the second and third time, I was like, what is that on his neck? She realized it was a bloody wound. I freaked out. I totally freaked out. I was like, oh my God. They demanded Salcedo bring Oreo back immediately. One of the first things I had noticed when I took the collar off of Oreo, it has these four prongs in it. And distinctly, you can see four spots on his neck. Sit Mean Sit's use of shock collars caused controversy in 2015 when two men with a St. Peter's, Missouri franchise were charged with animal abuse for using shock collars in a way that caused pain to four dogs. When Austin took off Oreo's shock collar. I had put it on level four and I could feel the shock from my hand through the tips of my ears and the top of my head. They took Oreo to the vet right away where an exam revealed raw sores on his paws, multiple wounds on his body, and this. So by the time the veterinarian shaved it down, I was, I was mortified. Pronounced burn marks on his neck from the prongs of the sit mean sit shock collar. I, I've been blaming myself. I've been crying a lot. Um, I'm so sorry. For what happened to him. After she confronted Salcedo via text, he promised a refund, writing, I feel terrible about this whole situation. I will make it right. He also left this voicemail message. I'm really working hard right now to try to get you your refund so I could give it to you ASAP because uh, I just want this to be done. I don't want to prolong it any more than it has to. And I'm, again, I'm, I'm, I'm apologizing again. Um, but we'll, we'll, we'll take care of it. Looks like the gate is locked. Nothing. Hello, anyone there? Was taken care of. After he did not return multiple telephone calls, emails, and texts, we tracked down Billy Salcedo at his central Las Vegas address. You can see all the evidence of the dog training tools, as well as the sit means sit signage. We can even hear multiple dogs barking from inside the garage, but there doesn't appear to be anyone at home. I made one last try to reach him before we left, and he finally answered. Hi, I've been trying to get a hold of you. I'm actually outside your house right now. Salcedo said he had no comment. <coughs> With wounds still healing... Good boy, you want to play catch? Oreo displays some skills he learned. Come here, boy. Can you sit? Can you sit? But his family says he's now distrustful, skittish, and nervous around strangers. I just want people to know it just, it can't keep going on like this. These poor puppies, you know, they trust you. 
When I first called Sit Me and Sit's corporate office, they said they had no comment. But later, the president called me, and he said he was very distressed by the pictures of Oreo's wounds and that they do not tolerate mistreatment of animals. He said they have pulled Billy Saucedo's corporate franchise license, so he is no longer with the company, and they've refunded the family $2,400 for their training and their vet bills. Darcy Spears, 13 Action News, Elevating Las Vegas.